Now the Blazers moving it up. On up the court. Williamson finds Doncic. That's good. And it's Williamson with the assist. Yeah, just pure shooting talent really sets Doncic apart. He's got touch, accuracy, and supreme confidence. And few players are as electric as Zion. The speed and power he plays with. Something you see once every few decades. Good on the shot. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Chicago leading. There's the double with Doncic. Out of bounds. It'll be Portland's ball. And the blend of speed and power, as you said, Grant, Zion is unmatched. He's a rhino with a jetpack. And on defense, when you see him coming in the open floor, you don't want to get in his way. The explosiveness in the paint is really what makes him so efficient. They get the rebound. Kicks it out to Williamson. And here's Thompson for three. On target from range. In full-on catch-up mode. They're raining threes right now. There's Young with the three. Goes back up. Over to the left wing. Here's O'Neal. Give him eight. Just five on the clock. The Bulls need to get off a shot. Tries again. Offensive rebound. Young. Bryant finds Young. Here's the three. Three-pointer. Can't hit that one. And it's Portland the other way. Well, he better buy his teammates dinner tonight because they covered him for what has been a terrible, absolutely terrible shooting display. A moment here for an injury report. Hey, guys, I got an update from the head athletic trainer of the Bulls. And this one, not something you hear often. A pinched nerve in his elbow. But from the sound of it, it's much more than just a funny bone. And for a team with definite title hopes, it will now be a case of next man up until he return. Well, and Ali, it appears that he needs some work done before he comes back to this one. And we all know that if it's something he can play through, he'll be back, no doubt. Boy, that foul looked intentional. Not exactly what you'd expect here. Yeah, I know. It just doesn't make sense given the situation. First team foul. Here's Thompson the ball. Oh, it's stolen away. Second half of play, and we're three minutes into the third here. Here's Moran. Takes it inside. And then Moran with the dunk. No, but it seems like Morant's got springs or something in his shoes. Pass to Williamson. Doncic on the wing. Gets the three to fall. Doncic has got six. They're doing the job on both ends. Getting stops and attacking offensively. All the momentum seems to be running in their favor. They're close to taking the lead. Making sure of it with the two-hand slam, B.A. Yeah, I don't blame him. With the score this tight, you cannot take a chance here. Oh, and they immediately answer back with a dunk on the other end. The team first mentality of Thompson. When someone on his squad is open, he finds them. Pass to O'Neal. Here's Chamberlain. And here's Morant, guarded by Doncic. And Morant gets it to go. Keeping pace here. That's an excellent move inside. The Trailblazers have gone six for nine in the half. To the middle. To the left side wing. Down low. Thompson passes to Doncic. Over to the wing. Six on the shot clock. Snaps the way. And a pass break now for the Bulls. And it's Vucevic. That time on the assist by Moran. Moran's got four assists now tonight. And an important part of every team's game. A look at the hustle stats for the Bulls. This is where Zion shines. Inside, he can be such a dominant force. And Morant gets double teamed. Pass to O'Neal. Takes one from 10 feet. And it's Ewing with a rebound. The Trailblazers have gone 7 of 10 here in the second half. To the inside. Olajuwon can't get it to go. Chicago has got nothing to fall here in the third. 0 for 4. Now Vucevic. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Vucevic has got four points in the quarter. Back to Doncic. Pass to Thompson. Off the mark there with a three. 
seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. And they go to the intentional foul for the Trailblazers. First personal foul. First team foul. So the Bulls shooting a solid 53% from the floor. Moran against Robinson. And then Moran with the dunk. That play is Morant's ball handling talent pretty much in a nutshell. Fast, smooth, and very effective. Portland has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Jordan, the pass to Ananakumpo. From the top of the key, Jordan with the bucket. Jordan's got the second bucket on the night. Just outstanding distribution. This is the kind of team chemistry that you love to see. Here's O'Neal. Trying to get that one to fall. And a great show through three quarters as we enter the fourth. Who will carry the day? Bulls out front. They lead by six. And we're coming back in just a moment. Get ready for the fourth quarter when we return. And a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. There wasn't a better pass in the game, almost like he had a sixth sense. Man, I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. And on the floor from Portland here in the fourth, they've got Anthony. And it's out of the Kupo in at the two. Nice one-handed jam. Simple and effective, B.A. Hey, with the lead, I'm surprised he didn't come up with something a little more creative. Anthony misses. Chicago leading. Vucevic with it. Guarded by Ana de Kupo. Chamberlain. It's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got rebound number seven tonight. Gets a very good look and converts. A quality pass, setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. Inside. Here's O'Neal. And a great assist by Moran as that one goes. Strong pass there to set up the basket. The Trailblazers shooting at about 44% so far. And here's Jordan. And Vucevic over to help. Jordan, the pass to Anthony. Three-pointer, no good. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's the shot he typically makes. Pass to O'Neal. Final quarter of play, about a minute and a half off the clock. <laughs> I just love that alley you play. Defense disorganized, defense pays. Oh, wasted no time on that one. This is what it's been Three. since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. In the modern NBA, you have to hit threes to win the game. And they've made that adjustment since the break. Here's Morant. Morant drawing the double team. To the paint. And he dunks it. What a pass to set him up. Ooh, he's earning his keep offensively. A key part of their winning effort at this point. Here's Morant. Nails it. He's now 6 for 8 from the floor. Their offense is really humming right now, and it's because of the beautiful ball distribution. Here's Jordan. Got a hand on it. Second chance shot. Anadokounmpo outside. Anthony, the pass to Anadokounmpo. Timeout called. Portland. RJ, you played with some of the greats. LeBron, Duncan, Dirk, Jason Kidd, just to name a few. But if the game were on the line, who would you want taking the last shot on the spot? I'm going to be really honest. I had the great situations with all of those guys, and they have all delivered. So this isn't, but I'm going to go with the person that's delivered the biggest shot of my career, and that was Kyrie Irving, and he hit the clutchest shot in NBA history. Argue with me if you want. You're going to lose it. No argument here. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. During that break, Coach 
Chauncey Billups had some advice for the team. And he was adamant that they need to tighten up their D. That lack of communication at that end has led to breakdowns, wide open shooters, and easy buckets. He sounded pretty frustrated, guys. Appreciate the report, Ali. Pass to Garnett. Here's Bull. No one near him. And it's Ewing with a rebound. Uh, I I'm trying to think of the last time I saw him miss a shot like that. It's, it's been a while. And it's slammed in by Carter. He just levitated in the air, double pump, and then slammed it home. How about the D right there? They just got out of the way. They let him choose what kind of move he wanted to make. Pass to Garnett. Clock at six. Here's Duncan. Down low. Here's Fall. No good with a layup. They're doing what they can do to mount a comeback. And B.A., they don't have to get it all back at once. Wait, just focus on making every possession count. From Patrick Ewing. The Bulls have gone 5 of 8 from the field so far in the fourth. Pass to Duncan. Beyond the arc. Here's Bryant. It's on target from the high post. When the defense gives you room, take it. Don't pass up the shot. Not a lot of time left for the Trailblazers in this one. And here's Harden. Thompson with it. Now guarded by Bryant. Harden from outside. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Blazers will retain possession. Portland ball. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. For Portland, they've got four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. And here's Ewing. Pass to Harden. On the wing, Thompson. The offensive rebound. Back to Harden. From behind the arc. That shot off. The shooter thought he had enough space, but the defender was right on him. Did a great job closing the gap, making the shooter feel uncomfortable. Here's Garnett. To the middle. Here's Fall. Nope. Four for seven now. 127 left in the fourth quarter. Pass to Olajuwon. Outside for Harden. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. I always love the hard work on the glass. Just great activity. Bryant with it. Here's Garnett. Defended by Thompson. And then Bryant with the no. Great job setting him up. The timing of the pass was key. Pass to Olajuwon. And so they choose to intentionally foul. I mean, I'm just not sure what he was thinking right there. I mean, he needs to get his head in the game. Some changes for Chicago. O'Neal comes in for fall. And it's Young in for Bryant. To the inside. Out to Anthony. Let's it go. Again, the miss by the Trailblazers. It hasn't been all bad shots for him. But you wouldn't know that looking at his percentage from the field. Oh, no good. So it's Portland now. They trail by nine. On to Kumpo. Here's Matumbo. Pass to Jordan. From the arc. They shoot again. It's tipped. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. To the left wing. Here's Duncan. Here's Garnett. Shoots over Robinson. And stolen by Anthony. Deflects the pass. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Robinson. Remains Chicago ball. Here's Garnett. And with an out-of-this-world wingspan, Giannis can simply lock up just about anyone on the defensive end. This one belongs to Chicago. A competitive game. You have to feel like this crowd gave him a little extra edge. Yeah, they really fed off the energy. You saw their activity level go up. Just a tremendous performance. And that about wraps it up. This is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching. We'll be back with us again soon.